guys. My name is Corwin Richardson. I'm a junior at Central High School, and today I'm going to be helping you work through the 16th note timing two note exercise. I know it's a little bit of a mouthful. So I've got a metronome set here to 80 beats per minute. I recommend that you do the same. Grab a pad playing along with me, and let's get started. So like most exercises that we do here in percussion, it's going to be uh, the exercises are going to be broken up into two different um, like patterns or, or stuff like that. So we've got um, uh, four beats of check that we're going to be playing throughout the entire exercise. Then we got the different patterns, and the exercise is going to go in the format of a, a measure of check, and then a measure of the pattern, and then a measure of the check, and a measure of your different pattern. So let's talk about the check real quick. The check for this exercise, since it's a 16th note based exercise, is going to be four beats of 16th notes counted, remember, one T te ta um, with the sticking right, left, right, left. I'll go ahead and play it for you right now. One, two, ready, go. One, two, take up, two, two, take up, two, two, take up, four, two, take up, one. Again, ready, go. One, two, take up, two, two, take up, three, two, take up, four, two, take up, one. So that's the uh, measure check that we're going to play in between each pattern. Uh, make sure that you use those right hand. Remember, the right hand is playing eighth notes in six, uh, when you're playing sixteenth notes alternated sticking. So make sure that that right hand lines up with those eighth notes. Kind of use that as a check uh, to make sure you're playing right with the metronome. So let's talk about some of the patterns now. So the first pattern that we're going to play, um, uh, what we do with this exercise is we take the four beats of sixteenth notes. Remember, there are four partials in, uh, in every uh, uh, four partials of 16th notes in every quarter note. And we're going to take those four partials and break them up into groups of two. The first group of two we're going to play is uh, the number and the T. And I'll go ahead and play it for you and then we'll talk about it. One, two, ready, go. One T, two T, three T, four T, one. Again, ready, go. One T, two T, three T, four T, So uh, basically what we did is we took the four partials, one T, te, ta, and we're only going to play the first two, the number and the T. That doesn't mean that we ignore the last two uh, partials, the te and the ta. We still need to make sure that we're subdividing through that space so we can come in right with the downbeat with the metronome. Because when we're playing it all together, we don't want to, um, we need to make sure that we're all playing right together with the metronome. So I'm going to play it again, and this time we're going to count all of the partials, one T, te, and ta, and we're only going to play the first two, one and T. All right, so play with me. One, two, ready, go. One T, take ta, two T, take ta, three T, take ta, four T, take ta, one. Again, ready, go. One T, take ta, two T, take ta, three T, take ta, four T, take ta, one. Awesome. So that's the first pattern. Um, I'll play it for you right now um, uh, twice, and we're going to count all of the 16th note partials. So uh, counting it's going to sound like this. 1T, ta, 2T, ta, 3T, ta, 4T, ta, 1T, ta, 2T, ta, 3T, ta, 4T, ta, 1. And then we're going to play the pattern. So remember, um, four beats of check, so we're going to play four beats of 16th notes, and then uh, the pattern, which is 1T, 2T, 3T, 4T, one, but still counting all the 16th note partials. Here we go. One, two, ready, go. One T take up, two T take up, three T take up, four T take up, one T take up, two T take up, three T take up, four T take up, one. Again, ready, go. One T take up, two T take up, three T take up, four T take up, one T take up, two T take up, three T take up, four T take up, one. All right, awesome. So that's the first pattern. Now let's move on to the second pattern. So remember with the first pattern, we took the first two partials uh, of 16th notes and we made that um, a pattern. Now we're going to take the last two partials and make that the pattern. So instead of one T, it's going to be mm, take top, take top, take top, take top one. So go ahead and play it for you and then we'll talk about it. One, two, ready, go. Mm, take top, mm, take top, mm, take top, mm, take top one. Again, ready, go. Mm. Take top, mm, take top, mm, take top, mm, take top one. All right, so this one is not attached to the down move, but you still have that tay to hold on to um, as a kind of timing device. So make sure that if you're tapping your foot, you're tapping right when it comes up or on the on the tay, and you can check yourself um, with the metronome using that tay. And also make sure that if you're tapping your foot along with the metronome, 
that right after the left hand plays on the ta, that your foot taps down on one. So you make sure you're in time. And also, like we said earlier, don't ignore those first two 16th note partials. Use those to your advantage and subdivide through that to make sure that you're coming in right on the tag. So we're going to play it again. I'll go ahead and play it with the check pattern before it, um, but this time we're going to count all the 16th notes and make sure that your hands are playing exactly with the metronome. Here we go. One, two, ready, go. One two take out two three take out three three take out four three take out one three take out two three take out three three take out four three take out one. Again, ready, go. One three take out two three take out three three take out four three take out one three take out two three take out three three take out four three take out one. Awesome. So that's the uh, first and second pattern done. Real quick, we'll go ahead and play what we have so far. Make sure that always you're subdividing through all those spaces and making sure that you're waiting the correct amount of time in between when you have the rest to make sure you come in right with the metronome. So go ahead and play it all together. Check pattern one, check pattern two. Here we go. One, two, ready, go. One T take out two T take out three T take out four T take out one T. Two T take out three T take out four T take out one T take out two T take out three T take out four T take out take out two T take out three T take out four T take out one. Again, ready. Go. One T take out two T take out two T take out four T take out one T take out two T take out three T take out four T take out one T take out two T take out three T take out four T take out one T take out two T. I messed up there. One more time. One, two, ready, go. One T take out two T take out three T take out four T take out one T take out two T take out three T take out four T take out one T take out two T take out three T take out four T take out one T take out two T take out three T take out four T take out one. Sorry about that, running out of breath there a little bit, but you get the idea. So that's the first two patterns. Now let's move on to the uh, third and fourth pattern. So these are gonna get uh, a little bit more difficult because we're not starting on the downbeat or the te, we're gonna start on the T and ta. So with the third pattern, we're gonna start on the T. So it's gonna be the middle two partials of the 16th notes. So it's gonna be T te, T te, T te, T te, one. So I'll go ahead and play it for you just by itself and then we'll talk about it. One, two, ready, go. T-T, 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 one. Again, ready, go. One, two, T-T, two, T-T, two, T-T, two, T-T, four, T-T, one. So a cool thing about this pattern is um, the left hand, you can just keep going instead of uh, playing a downstroke or stopping the, the hand like we had to do in pattern two. Uh, you can just keep that left hand going. That's what I use to make sure that my left hand comes in right on it because it is hard to come in on the T. So I'll play it uh, for you with the check and uh, I think you'll see what I'll mean. I'll explain a little bit more. One, two, ready, go. One T take out two T take out three T take out four T take out one T take out two T take out three T take out four T take out one. Again, ready, go. One T take out two T take out three T take out four T take out one T take out two T take out three T take out four T take out one. So when you're coming out of the check, like I, I just mentioned, when you're coming out of the check, make sure that you keep that left hand going um, from the check into the first beat of pattern to make sure that you come in right on the T uh, when you're playing. I'll play it for you one more time just so you know what I'm talking about. This I think is the hardest pattern. One. Two, ready, go. One T take out two T take out three T take out four T take out one T take out two T take out three T take out four T take out one. All right, so make sure that you practice that pattern a lot. I think it is the hardest pattern that it is in this exercise. So let's move on to the last pattern. So this one we're gonna um, on pattern three we play the middle two parts of the sixteenth notes. Now we're gonna play uh, like the I guess the outside pattern. Um, two notes of the 16th note. So it's going to be the downbeat and the ta. It's going to sound like this. One, ta two, ta three, ta four, ta one. So go ahead and play it for you and then we'll talk about it. One, two, ready, go. One T take ta two T take ta three T take ta four T take ta one. Again, ready, go. One T take ta two T take ta three T take ta four T take ta one. So, this is, um, I know I said earlier that this one will start on the top, I, you know, was thinking ahead, 
not true. So it's going to start on the downbeat, and then you're going to play ta one, ta two, ta three, ta four, ta one. And so that's the pattern. Remember, still subdivide between those, uh, the middle two, the T and the T. Still subdivide between those two so you can come in right on uh, the ta and then uh, play the right hand on the downbeat of one. That's what you can use to check yourself. Um, uh, subdivide, use that T right before you play the left hand, and then uh, make sure that that uh, downbeat on the right hand is on the downbeat with the metronome. So go ahead and play that pattern with the check, and then we'll play the entire exercise. Uh, at 80 beats per minute. All right. One, two, ready, go. One T take top two T take top three T take top four T take top one T take top two T take top three T take top four T take top one. Again, ready, go. One T take top two T take top three T take top four T take top one T take top two T take top three T take top four T take top one. All right. So that's all the patterns of the exercise. Um, real quick before we play it uh, all together, make sure that in between um, when you play and when you rest, you subdivide uh, those two sixteenth notes to make sure that you come in right with the metronome. So we've talked about it. Uh, we're going to play it at 80 beats per minute, and then we're going to go up about uh, 20 clicks to 100 and play it a little bit faster. Um, I would encourage you when you're practicing to play it a few times and make sure you get it perfect and then go up 5 to 10 beats on your metronome uh, to get it up to speed. Don't immediately go all the way up. It's going to be a little, uh, really difficult for you to do that. Uh, make sure that when you um, are playing this, you play with good technique, rotate from the wrists, uh, and use uh, good rebound strokes uh, from the pad. And then when you're not playing, make sure that your hand stays down, like we're going to talk about later with down strokes. So uh, we're going to play it all the way through at 80 beats per minute. I'm going to do my best to count all the way through without running out of breath, and then we're going to go play it at 100. Here we go. One, two, ready, go. One, two, take that, two, two, take that, three, two, take that, four, two, take that, one, two, take that, two, two, take that, three, two, take that, four, two, take that, one, two, take that, three, two, take that, three, two, take that, four, two, take that, take that, two, two, take that, three, two, take that, four, two, take that, one, two, take that, two, two, take that, three, two, take that, four, two, take that, two, take that, So that was at 80 beats per minute. Now we're going to go up to 100 beats per minute. Play it one last time. Excuse me. And one, two, ready, go. One, two, take that, two, two, take that, three, two, take that, four, two, take that, one, two, 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 three, two, four, two. Good job, hope this helped, and uh, I hope to see you soon.